Hi, today's question is regions of the DNA that contain many AT base pairs are the first to become denatured as the temperature of the DNA solution is raised. Why do you think AT rich regions denature first? And if you know the structure of the DNA, you would be able to answer this question right away. Or if you're not familiar with it, probably you wouldn't be able to answer this question using common knowledge or uh, logic. So here is the answer. You would be answer this question if you take uh, even a brief glance at this picture. And you would see that, uh, for example, thymine and adenine are connected with double bond, that is hydrogen bond, and uh, guanine uh, with cytosine are connected with uh, triple bond. And, of course, triple bond is much stronger than um, double bond. And where we can use this knowledge and why it's important, I will demonstrate, for example, if we take a genome of the bacteria, and bacteria genome is a circular, double-stranded DNA, and it has a region of replication, or RI site, uh, from which uh, duplication of each strand starts, and this region is a AT rich region. I would draw only three pairs here, for example, A, AT on one strand, and uh, T, T, A on the other strand. But in reality, for example, in uh, such bacteria as E. coli, this is uh, octanucleotide that is repeated three times at 24 bases that represents such a fragment that would be uh, relatively easier open for special binding protein that pulls more on uh, one strand and open such site and uh, replication starts. And for example, uh, human uh, genome is uh, much bigger than of the bacteria. It's about 1500 times bigger. And uh, each chromosome pair, and we have uh, 23 pairs uh, of chromosome, 46 together, has many replication sites along uh, each chromosome. So, uh, it enable to uh, duplicate chromosome uh, much faster than if they're going to be only one site uh, of replication just like in bacteria so in bacteria chromosome so uh, as you see um, chromosome might be replicated relatively fast uh, producing sister chromatid and um, there is also other practical applications. For example, if you take a um, DNA fragment, and this is uh, going to be um, AT rich region, uh, we may assume that uh, there should be a gene close to this region, because in order to uh, make uh, RNA from the gene to produce uh, protein later, we also have to open uh, DNA, double-stranded DNA. Um, so such sites help uh, open uh, DNA in certain places for the uh, special uh, protein that start uh, protein complexes start uh, DNA replication or uh, making a copy uh, RNA uh, message from the um, one of the strands that contains a gene. So, uh, if uh, scientists find such places on the DNA strand, this is a strong uh, evidence of the uh, gene that lies uh, close to this region. And also, 
Um, in genetic engineering, such knowledge can be uh, used. For example, if we um, if we uh, delete a fragment of this AT-rich uh, region, and uh, that means that it would be for binding proteins that open uh, two strands uh, it would be much uh, uh, much uh, harder to open them and we uh, expect that uh, much lower rate uh, of the RNA would be produced and in reality, uh, scientists uh, performed such uh, experiments and found that, for example, if uh, some of the um, some of some part of the um, AT rich region at the uh, origin of replication site would be deleted, that might lead to um, about tenfold uh, less. Uh, Activity activity would be reduced uh, about tenfold uh, of the uh, replication. So this is very important uh, uh, technique that may be uh, helpful making different uh, st uh, strains of the um, of the different bacteria that uh, might be helpful in different experiments. And uh, also some more information maybe that would be interesting for you that, for example, if we take such um, bacteria like Ar Archaea that is um, extremophile that lives, for example, in such places like uh, hot springs, uh, their genome consists much, have much more uh, G GC uh, basis in comparison with other bacteria and um, uh, in comparison with uh, eukaryotes and human genome uh, because uh, they live in uh, such hot uh, water that DNA uh, becomes unstable and the more bonds uh, it has be, uh, the more stable it is uh, so uh, there is different uh, applications and uh, hopefully this information will be interesting to you. Um, if you like uh, my video tutorial, please uh, thumbs up uh, and subscribe to my new videos, uh, about one to week, two videos every week. And that's all for today. Thank you for your attention and goodbye.